I'm sorry we had to have you uh, raise your hand on this. It changes how you kick. However, if this was a kickoff and you're raising your hand for the official, I want you to bring your hand back down before you start going. I want you to be set. Now take a look at this. You take a little jab and another jab and then one, two into this, okay? It already starts to move you left and now you miss hit, right? We gotta have that locked out toe, lifting up your big toe uh, as you go towards the target. Notice here, you take a step over like you're gonna go soccer style. Now you're already off target. You're gonna push this to the right, okay? So what I want you to do is I want you to take jab and one, two, not these two little baby steps. This first step is a waste of energy and a waste of time, and you don't have time to spare. So don't start with your right foot, start with your left foot. You might wanna ch change up your stance a little bit. And so notice this, as you come into this, you get a good hit on this ball, you are moving to the target as if you're gonna kick it right where you kick it. If you're gonna be a straight on kicker, then stay straight on. Be at the right angle that you wanna get to the posts and hold onto those shoulders a little bit more square. You wanna be able to walk straight towards the target. This is a nice hit, but you'll notice that your energy basically is moving right where the ball went. So again, you, you cheat over here a little bit left. You're not a soccer style kicker, don't be. Be a straight on kicker. Give yourself every chance to, to get this kick straight at the field goal post. So again, you're moving this stuff around and you end up moving even further left, right? And so it just changes where you can strike on the ball and how well you're going to and consistently hit it. And so we don't always hit it consistent. This is nice, right? You get through it. I just want you to get square and make a good kick.